No coach in University of Miami history has achieved such immediate success as Larry Coker did when he took command of the University of Miami football program. As head coach, Coker won his first 24 games without a defeat. I, I, I've never been prouder of a team, anybody in my entire life, guys. You, you went through this entire year, the distractions, the pressure. You're number one, you're number four, you're going to get left out. You got left out last year, you just practiced. Played. You got close, you got tight, you got to be a unit. Offense, defense, special team. You never flinched, guys. You never flinched today. You never flinched. You never flinched. Really, really proud of you guys. We're going to the ship. Before becoming head coach of the Hurricanes, Coker served as offensive coordinator for six seasons as Miami began to amass perhaps the greatest collection of talent in college football. Edwin James. Behind the block, the Fulcher has five, has ten, he's loose. Gets a block downfield, and he will score. When Butch Davis left Miami for the NFL's Cleveland Browns after the 2000 season, Coker was named head coach, and his 2001 Hurricanes began a season that will be forever remembered. Miami finished the 2001 regular season with an undefeated record and went on to face Nebraska in the Rose Bowl for the national championship. In the end, the big game wasn't even close. At the Nebraska 21-yard line, Dorsey back, looking to the end zone. It's touchdown, Shucky! Wow! They're making it look easy. Under Coker, Miami's offense set school records for most points scored in both 2001 and 2002, when the Hurricanes again went undefeated in the regular season. In six years, Coker's teams posted a record of 60 wins against just 15 defeats, an 80% winning percentage that is third all-time in Miami history, only behind Hall of Fame coaches Dennis Erickson and Jimmy Johnson. During his time at Miami, both as head coach and as an assistant, Coker coached 22 members of the UM Sports Hall of Fame and 23 All-Americans. Tonight, it's Larry Coker's turn to join the many players he helped mold into Hall of Famers. Let's welcome Larry Coker into the University of Miami Sports Hall of Fame. <laughs> 